so it's Saturday today. Some coffee. Coffee and a Danish. Oh my goodness, we've actually got we've actually got Danishes in the fridge. We've actually we've actually got Danishes in the fridge. Apple Danish in the fridge. Oh my goodness. Can you smell that? Look at these. Apple Danish. You like roll it out and then that's from what I gather, and then you just shove it in the oven. So, this is it. This is the, the wonderful. This is going to happen. You got some apple sauce there. And you get this tin. And it opens in the coolest way ever. Let me, let me, let me attach you to a thing and then I can actually do it properly. Okay, so you've got the apple stuff. And then here, it says pull the corner of the red label down to the left, down, expose line to open the can, oh look at that, and there's all the dough, look at that, just a roll of dough. Unroll the dough, separate it into pieces where perforated. So there's little like cuts in there. You unroll the dough. We'll just make two, we'll just make two. Fold two opposite corners into the centre of the pastry. And then it says. Uh, and prick with a fork to secure their folded shape when baked. Is that right? Okay. Now, place one teaspoon of the apple filling on top of the forked area. I've even got a little measuring thing here. Look at that. Mm. That's like measures. Measures the apple sauce. I'll put a bit of apple sauce in the middle of it. <coughs> and then whack it onto a tray, shove it in the oven, boom. Meanwhile, whilst the uh, Danish pastries are in the oven for 10 to 14 minutes, 12 to 14 minutes, you can create some icing sugar to like sprinkle on top. Okay everyone, 12 to 14 minutes has passed. Finished. So now... Oh, look at them! Oh my goodness, they look amazing! I'm like genuinely so pleased with that. Okay, cool. So, do I... Oh, do I do put the icing on now? Or do I wait? Oh man, do I do it now? Do I do it now? I don't want to ruin it because the thing is, if you put put the icing on when it's too hot and it then runs everywhere, then that ruin it. But then actually, I still want to eat them warm. So mm. I don't even know if the icing's too runny. It might be too runny. It might be too runny. Is that too runny? Okay, I put the icing on it. It's not the best. So I have made them now, and this is it, the taste test. Now oh, it'll be popping nice. Mm. Do you like it? Mm. Heather likes it. I like it. Send me to the Bake Off. I'll wait for the call from Paul Hollywood or Mary Berry. I'm waiting.